<sighs> this place isn't what it used to be. Back in 2025, it was my home. Shikishima is a conglomerate with political ties. They made it big during the Meiji modernization. You always see their branches on employer of the year lists. Back in the Meiji era, they were shipbuilders. But they expanded into aviation and a bunch of other things. During the war, they did a lot of weapons R&D. And now they make everything from home appliances to rockets. Shikishima Industries is just one of those branches. Their machinery is known all over the world. How's Senpai doing? She was struggling for a while. But I think she's calmed down. We need to get her to a doctor. Maybe, but how are we supposed to do that? Shinonome Senpai. Do you think she came here at the same time? Probably. We'll figure it out when she wakes up. Anyway, once that moron gets back, let's decide what to do from here. Okay. Shinonome Senpai. I saw her hanging around Goto. Maybe she's from the future too. Oh, there you are. Nice of you to drop by. I'm back, Miwako. You've got some nerve. What? I take my eyes off you for one second, and you just go running off looking for your own house? We were waiting for you, you know. Yeah? And how's that sickly-looking second year? Well, she hasn't woken up yet. You are stuck here either way. You're really gonna give me that? So how was it? Before we get into that, here, have a drink. Copped it from a busted vending machine. You too. We're not gonna last long without food and water. There should be cans lying around if we look. Um, thanks. You're thirsty, right? Go ahead and drink. It ain't cold anymore, but it should be fine. <sighs> hey, I found a calendar when I was digging around. The year on it was 2025. Guess this really is the future. Everywhere I looked, the place has fallen apart. It's no different from here. But I'm telling you, there was some crazy shit out there. Like what? Kaiju. Dead ones everywhere. One was like a metal centipede. Big as a truck. Another one was real stocky. The size of a damn building. They were just lying all over the place. I never liked creepy crawly things. I couldn't stand to look at them too long. How did you know they were dead? How do you think? They were torn apart. It was pretty obvious. Ugh. What? You need to see it to believe me? So, did you find your house? You could say that. But I wasn't there anymore. Guess it got replaced by some skyscraper. Wasn't looking so hot, though. What about my place? Sorry, but it's the same deal. Place is nothing but a giant parking lot. What about Mom and Dad? If this is 2025, that means 40 years have passed. Your guess is as good as mine. I wonder what happened to my place. I should look for my place. I need to see if my parents are okay. It's my turn to head out. Sorry, 
Just wait here for a bit. Usami-chan! Hey, wait! Miwako, stay back with that second here. Get that out. I gotta stay strong. You don't have to push yourself. If you wanna cry, then cry. <laughs> don't be stupid. I'm not crying. Oh, yeah? What's with the voice then? You got a cold or something? I always sound like this. Whatever you say. There was a cake shop on the first floor. They had this pear tart I used to get. It was so good. Megumi and I. We loved those things. That one of your friends? Yeah. Megumi. You saw what was happening here. That's why you... to me like what I'm supposed to go to class and pretend everything's normal well it's not this place is 40 years old those girls over there they look about my age, but back home, they must be in their 50s. That's too weird. Sorry for making you wait, Miwa-chan. Miwa-chan, where were you? There was a bed available in the nurse's office, so I took a nap. You skipped six period for that? I didn't really mean to, but yeah. When I woke up, class was already over. <sighs> I messed up. That's the girl who sits behind me in class. Must be nice. Oh well. No point feeling sorry for myself. Time to check out the library. We need to find some dirt on Shikishima. But geez. Not having a smartphone is suffering. you're okay. Megumi, what happened to our city? You were there, right? You stayed back. Well, my mom and dad, they're fine, right? Goto's just making things up. Tell me it's all a big lie. It has to be, right? just walked by. That's Izumi, right? He's in my class here, so I've seen him around. But when I talk to him, he's like a totally different person. He's all nervous and stuff. It's weird. Did something happen? Oh. As a result of battle, he... He lost his memories. Huh? Like, he hit his head? It'll all come back, right? No. They said it was permanent. No way. So he really is a different person at this point. Does that mean he doesn't remember you? Oh. What now? Are we supposed to just give up on him? 
I could never, ever do that! I'll never give up on him! I can't! I'm sorry. <laughs> Megumi. I'm so sorry. 